home. Today we're gonna play the final battle of Berlin. Yeah. It's gonna be awesome. Yeah, it's gonna be good to be back in the game. It's been a long time since I played Bolt Action. Yes, we've been a little bit sick, you know, having the trouble with kids and stuff. Uh, but I'm Hoka, and this is Lars. No, here it's Lars. There, there is Lars. The heart. No, the heart. I don't know. Anyway. That's Tabletop Battle, that's Lars. <laughs> yes, the last game was uh, produced by uh, Martin and Sven, and they were in the outskirts of Berlin. Now the Russian has pushed forward, and they are entering the the, the park just out, just in front of the Reichstag. Yeah, the public, pu public square, public area in front of the Reichstag. Yes. So they're going to try and do the final push. But, uh, if I remember right, uh, Swine and Martin said that they're... Germans did very well the last game. Yes, so no preparatory bombardment, so it's just cookie cutter armies on both sides. Yes, no preparatory bombardment because uh, kind of tried to have the timeline going. Yeah. So we're gonna show you the battle, uh, the field, and the armies. And uh... oh, hey guys, uh, you guys have probably already bought the tabletop battle dice and the tabletop battle dice bags and all that sort of stuff. But if you guys want shirts like this with the Tabletop Battle logo or coffee cups or stuff, we just started branding merchandise. So just click the link thingy. Uh, I don't know where he's going to put it. I think it's going to be around here. And use our web shop. Okay, and here we have the Reichstag burning in the, in the background. That's the Russian objective. But to get there and raise the flag, they need to push through some really hardened Germans here and you can see there is a tiger too it's got fuel shortage but uh, hi it's a tiger too it's awesome it's gonna be probably devastating defending the Reichstag is uh, here is the SS late war platoon with two Panzerfaust they are of course veterans Veterans of the Long War, Come, if that's not another war. No, it's a long war, this, definitely. And here we have two groups of Volksgrenadier, regular, 10 men, two Panzerfaust each, nothing special. We have a machine gun, medium machine gun team over here. Sniper is hiding somewhere in the field. We got the medium howitzer. It's one of my favorite pieces to play with. They are regular. And we got, of course, my second lieutenant here looking sinister. And if you can have a free... Uh, if you can have a free gun, of course, you have it over there. Everything is regular except for the veteran squad. Oh, and of course... Big bad tiger too. Okay, so the Russian force, Lars is busy doing stuff, so I'm gonna take it for him. And he's been busy painting here. So uh, here is actually Shukov. Shukov, and what's the name of the other guy? Tomachenko. So uh, since it's the last days of the battle, and the Russians should be in a good position here. They will get him, he, we upgrade him, the second lieutenant, to a major, because, yeah, we just felt, it felt right. So it's a major. And then we have this badass squad. I painted them up recently, I really like them. It's the Russian, Russian, uh, oh, oh, sorry, assault engineers. Assault engineers, and they are equipped exactly as they are uh, from the from the box we got a flamer we got a light machine gun flamer and light machine gun got some submachine guns they got that that body armor i haven't played with the body armor so we'll see if i can take them out even if i painted them they're metal so i put some art coat on so they are good to go and some anti shine we want that yeah you definitely want that they are of course veterans then we have the rifle squads we have the inexperienced rifle squads, tank rider squad, and guard squad. And here is the sniper. You gotta have a Russian sniper, don't you? The God of War, C3 over there. If anyone noticed, there's not correct uh, dudes handling it. 
forgot them, sorry. Oh, oh, the flag is coming. The flag, if the flag enters the building, yeah, it's not even a moral victory, it's a super victory. And for tanks, we got the T-34-85. He's gonna have a hard job for in front of him, facing that Tiger too. But, you know, that's how it is. And the SU-152 with the uh, with the uh, big gun, of course, with the... Oh, I forgot it! With the heavy howitzer! He's gonna destroy my infantry! Oh yeah, he will. And of course a truck, because you know, you gotta have a truck. And that's the fa forces facing each other on this last days of World War II in Berlin. So here is the field of battle. The Reichstag burning in the background. And there was a small, uh, small, uh, not a river, but small stream, I guess. Uh, after the maps we tried to shake out, try to make the battlefield uh, we are not playing historically correct, but at least similar. So the objectives for the Russians, which will be entering here. Lars has put up his army over here. He will go through it in a couple of minutes. They're gonna push through here, trying to catch the row, uh, the bridge. Objective. First objective, it's a three, but it's a <laughs> first I'll show you. We got another objective over here. Another bridge, and then of course, Right in front of the Reichstag, we got the major objective over there. So uh, playing this, it's going to be basically kind of simple. If the Russians take all three objectives, they are of course winning a major victory. If they can conquer the bridges, they win a minor victory. If the Germans can at defend all three objectives, they win a major victory, but if they lose one of the bridges, they win a minor victory. So hard for the Russians to push, but it's uh, it's uh, not easy defended by the Germans here. They have to, they can't just stand back at the Reichstag and let the Russians rush forward. They have to secure the bridges because you know, one last push, one last push. Oh, hey guys! Uh, you guys have probably already bought the Tabletop Battle Dice and the Tabletop Battle Dice Bags and all that sort of stuff. But if you guys want shirts like this with the Tabletop Battle logo or coffee cups or stuff, we just started branding merchandise. So just click the link thingy. Uh, I don't know where he's going to put it. I think it's going to be around here. And use our web shop. Alright. Here we go. First dice of the game. And the Russians are, of course, entering the battlefield, as they want. All the Germans are deployed. They are not holding anything in reserve here. It's the Reichstag. It hasn't been used in like, since like 33 or whatever. But anyway, it's the Reichstag. So they are not holding anything in reserve. Let's hope it's the red dice for me. Or for Lord. Ha! Oh, oh! Germany! Here we go. Okay, I'm gonna take a chill and uh, go down with my officer. Not doing anything special. Waiting the Russian horde coming for me. All right, Lars, are you ready? Yes. Ah, me again. Oh, that was not the plan. Did you remember to put my dice in the bag? Yeah, I did. There's a lot of red dice there. Anyway, that's how it works. That's how it works. I think I will put, um, yeah, what can we do here? I'm not gonna advance just yet. I'm gonna do some ambush here on the, on the I, put the, uh, I put the machine gun here on the main objective. Probably not the best idea, but I don't care. I think it looks very nice over there. So that's how I play it today. We just play fun, aren't we? Ah! Oh, Lars! <gasps> ah! This is not going good for the Germans again, but I can just put some more ambush thing, I guess. That's how uh, Martin always plays, and he basically he just wins with me every time. Uh, okay. 
Oh, ambush. Ooh. Ooh. Ambush on the big cat. On the big cat. Statistically, if I get another dice, they have to rewrite statistics in mathematics. Yeah, here we go, Lars. What will you do? Yeah, um, I don't like a tiger. You don't? No. I'm a, I'm a dog kind of guy, not a cat kind of guy. You're not a cat guy. So I want to take it out. Or at least try to take it out because that well, that's half your army. Just leave my edge. sweet, sweet <clears throat> alone. So I, ha I have this little beauty here. Oh yeah, I recognize I, I, this I, one. It, uh, one SU 152. Yes, it's a howitzer. It's not the uh, heavy anti tank gun. Exactly. Uh, the barrel is a little bit too green because I painted this morning. So I'm go just going to go come in here on the side. Okay then. Try to get some cover between us, but still keep line of sight. Keep line of sight. All right. So I can Ooh. 12 inches. We got definitely got some long range here. And then I'm going to shoot you. That's long range movement. Long range movement. No light cover. No. Are you sure? Another one? No, I don't think so. It's no. a big cat. It's a big cat. You don't get cover that easy. Some small bushes. Some small bushes. You're gonna burn right through them. Yeah. Okay, so what that makes you hitting on a... Eh? Five. Oh, that's actually... It's not good odds, but it's definitely doable. But it's a higher so don't shoot you indirect, so it's six regardless. Six regardless. Okay, then. No! Lars! That's not a six! That's a one. That's a one. Please take another dice for us. Uh huh. But uh, can I activate my ambush then? Yes. I think I will. If you want to activate it for that one. I think I'll wait. Because I can shoot you later. And then it's Germany again. Germany again. Okay, so ambush again? Yeah. Ambush again on the sniper team. Here is my sniper team. So just go to dig in and just wait out. Yeah, because I don't really have so much targets. I'm gonna wait a little bit with my tiger to activate ambush. I think it's just sitting there, looking mean. Imagine if you managed to take out my two field marshals with your tiger. Oh, that would be, that would be fun. <laughs> historically, very incorrect. <laughs> very. Good. But we're not playing historically. No. Correct. We're playing historically. Uh, anyway. The next dice goes to Russia. Okay, I'll, I'll just go go or mount into the truck with my assault engineers so they can move in faster, hopefully. Oh, they went down in the truck, did they? Then, so uh, again. Russia again. Okay, what are you bringing to the table? Now I'm going to bring mm. in the free infantry squad. The free infantry squad, all right. Okay, here comes the Russians. Yeah. Yes, inexperienced. This is the free infantry. Newly recruited. Yeah. From Mother Russia. Yes. Well. Um, and since they are inexperienced, they just come rushing into the battle, eager to face their ultimate uh -huh. doom. The ultimate doom. All right then. You know, that's where the glory is. Another Russian. Okay then. What are your plans, Lars? Then I'm going to bring in the guard squad. The guard squad! Oh! Here comes the one who will do the job. And they're also going to run in. They are, of course, running. Yes, I got my sniper there. Thinking about maybe picking out some flag. Okay, then. Here they come. Now we're getting started with some action. Not just the waiting. Not just the waiting. While well, I show you the field of battle. Lars is showing another die. And the color is red for Mother Russia again. What will you bring to the table this time, Lars? This time I'm thinking about bringing my sniper team. Your sniper team? Oh, will there be a sniper duel? 
Oh, here is my cruel sea while Lars thinking my cruel sea by a dice bag, which I like, Italian one. Ah, oh, he's got somewhere thinking here. Okay, the sniper is moving behind the building. He's running in. Yes, he's running in. Does he have line of sight to my sniper? That's the question. He doesn't have line of sight to anything. To anything, okay. Yes. As you can see, I'm taking another red die. Of course, there's a lot of red dice here. So let's see. Okay, now we're now we're talking. Now we're talking. Lars, what's happening? This is my tank rider is going down on the tank. The tank rider is going on uh, down on the tank, and the next guy is Germany. All right, uh, the Russian Germans they are not waiting. They're moving, they're taking a run up here. They want to be a little bit more aggressive, getting up, securing this flank. And getting in the line of sight for my sniper. Oh, yeah. Me like. That's okay. Because I'm gonna take you out. And that's what they do. We'll see about that. We'll see about that. Next die is. Oh, there's a couple of grey and a couple of red. Red one. Yeah, uh, I'm going to run in my cis divisional gun. Okay then, here they come. Yes, it's medium, so it can run six when it's fixed. Yeah, and uh, six is sufficient, so it's ready for round two. And the next die is Russian. Another Russian. Another Russian. No, I'm seriously All starting right. to run out of models. Running out? Of, are you running out of models? Oh my god. So. I'm going to bring in my T-3485 with the tank riders. Okay then! What will happen when I say maybe? Well, here it comes. Russian T-3485. It's definitely one of the most iconic tanks. And he's advancing and shooting. I'm ambushing! With My Tiger too. If I can. Yes, you can, but I'm claiming some sort of cover, etc. on this one. Of course. Long range and... Yeah, we'll see. One cover? Mm. Hmm. We'll come back. I can see you quite qu clearly, so we say it's light cover. So the tank barricades, we agree they're light cover. Because they don't, uh, it's a big tank, I see you quite good. So we decided for a, uh, for a, uh, a light, uh, light cover. Yeah. And it's kind of, kind of... Light cover for vehicles and hard cover for... Infantry. Yeah, definitely, because uh, it's a big tank. So that means I will hit you on a 5-up. And Lars, you don't want to see that 148 tactic sign here now. On the nope. five. All right. Are you ready? No. Oh! That's a four. That's, a four. That's just out of. And then I'm going to re retaliate. Of course I'm you shooting. will. <laughs> yes, please do. Okay, so I'm going to shoot my anti-tank gun at long range on the tiger. Yes. I'm going to shoot my machine gun at those guys. Machine gun at the ex ex experienced veteran. The last, probably from some bunker close by. Okay then. So that's long range, light cover, movement, yeah. hitting on a six. Hitting on a six. It's nah, Lars. They probably. And by the way, since I, we forgot to tell you, we're playing with the new Tiger uh, Fear rules. So you have to be within twelve, if I remember yeah. correctly. That's correct. So no Tiger Fear, but you fired on it anyway. And okay. machine gun on those guys. That's long range, movement. Hard cover, so sixes followed by sixes. Sixes by sixes. Is there? Ah, oh, that's that's one forty eight there. One forty eight. And but not a six by a six. All right, Lars. They probably were feeling the sweat when the big eighty eight. Is it more than eighty eight on this one? I ah uh, anyway. <laughs> Super heavy tank. Oh my turn. Uh, I've decided that my medium howitzer has um, located the target, that's a CIS-3 over there. And I got my spotter hiding just behind here. I didn't, don't think I said it, 
I had one, but here is the spotter, and he's just checking out. So he, they are attacking that sis. So it's indirect fire. Heading on a six. Heading on a six. Can we see some action now? We don't see any action just yet, but I will put my five dice over here. So indicating that they are ranging in the artillery piece, trying to strike out Germany again. All right, that's the question. Do I have anything in range for my... Uh, what you have left, you have... I have my two infantry squads. Yep. I don't think they have any range, so they will actually just go down, waiting a little bit, because I'm close to the objective, I can chill a little bit. Alright, Russia, from Russia with love. Okay, so I have my truck and my officers left, so I'll bring in my truck. Bring in the officers. No, the truck with the... the truck! With oh, assault. The assault engineers! And since the engineers are already down, I'm going to run into the truck. But yeah, just uh, drive away. But the roads are blocked, so I have to run in. Over Why the are they blocked, Lars? Because someone didn't use their... <laughs> that's the thing, when we feel, we don't think just too long ahead. Anyway, that's how it is. But the truck is just fine over here. Just fine over there. Alright, and that's a scary engineer squad coming for the Reichstag. Yeah. Yes, it is. And that's on the outskirts, more south to Berlin, they're coming. Hmm. Yes. Two days right. left. One German, one Russian. One German, one Russian. Ah! Lars! Yeah. Last, last infantry squad? No. No? Officers. Of course, the officers. Shukov himself is coming. He wasn't here, of course, in real life. Uh, but uh, anyway, we are not playing historically correct missions. We we play for fun. So I'm just going to move in here. With a flag. You got a flag. Oh, I think I got a sniper in ambush, don't I? Yeah, but... Uh, 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 uh. This is a slight matter of line of sight. <laughs> oh, Lars. What did you do? Where else can I put them? <laughs> okay, my dice is left. Did I talk too early? I talk too much. Everyone knows that. Oh, this squad is going down. Because they are out of range and I haven't bought any machine guns on them. The sniper is activating now. He's gonna try and fire on this uh, infantry squad because uh, Lars didn't put his, in, his uh, officers in line of sight. So, uh, but I have to take a moral test. Let's see if I make it. No problem! And the sniper is firing on a 3 plus. Don't have to check anything there. Shouldn't be a problem with range. No, should be good. Is it 36? Yeah. Yeah, no problem. We can just do it because we are playing on camera and yeah, 31. So I got 5 inches with no problem. Hitting on a 3. That's a one. No! No blood first turn. Okay, so it'll clean up and be back with round two. Start with round two. And the dice is... Oh! Damn it's it. great! No, Lars! Why? You... Damn it. Since you had a major on the field, you could have done some serious snap two here. Oh, I'm still going to do it. Trust me. It's still, I am gonna do activate my tiger, and he is just going to. Yeah, but you have some tests you have to do on him, don't you? Fuel shortage. Fuel shortage, but I'm not gonna move. Ooh. At least for now, because I was first saying that I would move to Lars, but uh, then I just realized I need to take one tank out because the firepower from that snap too. It's gonna be devastating. So he's gonna just sit there and fire, and he knows he's uh, running on fumes. So he's firing. And I am 100% no, sure that the machine gun is out of range. So here comes. Which one are you shooting at? 
you got light cover whatever I do and long range I'm shooting at the T34 with the heavy anti-tank gun the one with the this one yeah the one with the tank riders yes so when you're shooting them those guys have to disembark that's true let's do that yeah so we'll be back with after the disembarkment of the tank riders Long range. Long range, soft cover. Soft cover. Five up. Can I do it this time? Here we go! No! Outside the table, I got two in. It was a four. If anyone wondered. But off table doesn't count, Lars. Doesn't count. Here we go! Oh! There's a six, Lars. Now we're getting action. And this baby is. Super heavy. So you got plus seven on penetration. I have low range, you. so it's plus six. Plus six, yes. And this one has a nine front armor. Unfortunately, yes. Go uh, ahead. Uh, 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 but you, I, I still have to roll the dice. So this result plus six is. Oh no, Lars. 11, that's two more than the front armor. So just one dice on the damage table. One dice on the damage table, Bill. Can I finish him off? Can I finish him off? I do finish him off! Lars, no! Why? What's happening? I put some time and effort in painting that tank. Now I'm killing it. Why would I do that to myself? And you, you insisted on using your type because it was better painted than no, mine. No, it wasn't better painted, but it was similar to come the other on, tank. Come on, come on, it was better painted. Except for the few, <laughs> except for the for the barrel on the S1. Well, nevertheless. Yes. First blood. First blood. Damn it. First blood, the Russians, but they were suffering heavy casualties in the uh, Berlin fight. So uh, Remove a red die, please. I do remove it. Lars, can you retaliate? Oh, oh, maybe that tiger is gonna do the game. We'll see. I feel for you now, Lars. I feel for you. But you can retaliate with the major officer. And I'm going to snap to... Seriously snap to here. <laughs> so serious. So we'll be right back. So serious snapping here. Okay, so since I have a major on the table, that's four guys snap to, plus his own. That's half my army activated in one turn. Oh yes, Lars. That's how you do it. Yeah. Chukov on the table. So I'm going to start doing some action. So I'm going to start with this one. Okay, what will he do? Will he fire at the tiger again? He's going to advance up here. Oh, oh, oh. Staying within covers from your ti tiger, but negating the cover when I shoot at the tiger next turn. Okay, so you're not gonna fire at the tiger. No, I'm going to fire at your veterans. Ah, oh, Lars. Why would you do that to my veterans? Because I don't want them there. I spent a lot of time painting these dudes. Yeah. Okay. So, so that's the reason. And I'm shooting. Doesn't matter whether I shoot direct or indirect. Uh, probably you will get minus. You will hit on sixes anyway. Yeah. Okay. Can you do it this time, Lars? Nah. You nope. you oh, you run once when you're supposed to roll a six. You know why? It's the curse of the borrowed dice. Those are your dice. Oh no, that's how I do it. Yeah. Okay, and next? Next I'm going to activate my CIS-3 divisional gun. Yes, CIS-3 gun. And he's just going to stay and shoot. Alright, what's his target then? His target are those guys. Yes, I and think that's wise. And they get soft cover. So you will fire with the uh, light howitzer, I guess? No, that's 30 inches. That's exactly half the range, so I don't get long range. Oh, good. So Very it's just good. Soft cover. Yes, soft hitting cover. On a four. Hitting on a four. Because hitting on six is man. Bro dies. Yeah. No! Ah! Lars, not this game. Not this game. This is not how you do it. Okay, well, but you still got some orders to do. Then I'm going to activate these dudes. Yes. They're just going to advance. They are taking the fight to the enemy because the bayonet is the best weapon in a firefight. Someone say. Or did they? I'm not sure. Oh, I read on Quora the other day um, on when you should use your bayonet. 
Mm-hmm. It was essentially never. <laughs> you should. <laughs> yeah, you, 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 but they did. The all, 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 only time you should use your bayonet is when you have when you're out of ammo. When you're out of ammo, because any bullet is better than an arrow. Most probably, but they didn't get the memo. No. And you need to advance. It's the second turn. You have to advance, secure the objectives. And I'm going to shoot at your guys. Shoot at my guys. Okay then. And that's twenty-four inches, isn't it? The range. Uh. Yeah, yeah, you can get some dices, definitely. Eight of them. Eight boys firing. Is that the inexperienced? Uh, That's the inexperienced dice. It's the inexperienced ones. So, what will they hit on then? So, it's movement, long range, inexperience, they're hitting on six. So, oh, sixes and sixes. I'm not going down. I'm gonna fire back. Okay then. There is no... Lars, what is happening? Oh! You I've, make it too easy for me! I've, Why? Curse the brown eyes. If those were mine, it would be different. <laughs> yeah! And... But you I've, still got some snapping to do, I'm, I'm, don't you? I'm tempted to prove it. Okay, you're gonna prove it! Okay. But I'm not not gonna, you know, Look at you this. That this is eight make dice. sure you exactly don't exactly the same. You don't roll those dice. Ah, oh, there's the six. <laughs> but you got these boys. They are two running, aren't they? Are they advancing or running? Um, because they are not going back. They are going to there's ad a... advance over here. Okay. And shoot at those same guys. So yeah, uh, so so advance towards forward, following the road. Shooting at the same boys. So you probably get similar amount of dices. Let's see if your dice can do any better. Yeah, but remember here I have four dudes with SMGs. Oh, they are... Uh, uh, it's a long way with SMGs. You got some rifles. One, two, three, four. Four rifles. But they're not inexperienced. So waiting on fives. Hitting on fives. Those guys are veteran. They are actually veteran scorpions. Oh yeah, no problem. So one hit. One hit. That's a uh, pin marker for me. And your guys are... They are regular. So one guy die. Mm. Ah! Finally. Ah, finally! Something on the German side. Uh, okay, so your officers... Find some pin yeah, we'll find them. No problem. No problem. So that, that was those guys and yes. then my officers. What would they do then? Watch out for the sniper. There's a sniper lying there. They're just going to move. No, I want to snap to. I want to snap to effect. Your sniper is over there, so mm -hmm. my officers are going to move over here. Okay. Because. I can't resist taking a sniper shot on Shukov if I'm able to. Shukov and... Oh, I forget the other guy's name again. Tomoshenko. Tomo Tomoshenko. Yeah. Tomoshenko. They are talking there. Yeah. Disgusting. How will we divide Germany? Yeah. And we are victorious. Because they will be victorious no matter oh, how no. bad you roll on the dice. That was all those dice. Okay. And the next die will be... Germany. Okay. I will make it easy for me. This howitzer is firing. And he's hitting on a 5-up. On your sis. Because I don't want anything pins on this one. 5-up! And... Oh! Lars! What's happening? I'm... I'm... Destroying your sis gun here! It looks like this is going to be a second assault on the rack side. <laughs> <laughs> yes! Okay. Okay, um, so you got three uh, three boys. I hit them all, all three of them. Yeah. It's not four, it's three. I, no, it's three. And I um, medium howitzer. So plus four, isn't it? Something like that. I mean, medium howitzer three, or plus three, sorry. And you can't go down because you already fired. Yeah. So I kill you on twos. Yes. There is one. 
There are two boys dead. And pins, how many pins will they get? It's the... D3. The three. The three? Oh no. Three. What's happening, Lars? What's happening? And the next die is Germany again! Germany again, okay, what will I do? Fire with this one. He's supposed to be there. And I think I will just take my uh, machine gun here, firing. Machine gun is gonna fire on that rifle squad over there. And can you do me the favor and check out if I'm in range? I think I am within 36. This machine gun is firing on the squad there. No, it's actually 37. It's 37! Oh no! So I miss. Anyway, that's how he was worth the shot. He's probably not gonna fire at that one anyway. And Russia. Now Lars! Now, what's your plan? Now my plan is to move the truck and... Disembark! Yeah. Disembark. The assault engineers. Oh, now it's getting closer. Now the action starts. So next time. Okay, Lars. Here's the deal. We pre-measured. Lars didn't think it, but I gave the order dice to my sniper. He needs sees Chukov. He sees Chukov and he's 35 inches away. Yeah, so I missed with one inch. You missed with one inch. I will hit him on a three up. Oh no, Lars. But is he a veteran or is he regular? Uh, he is by definition veteran. He is by definition. So I have to kill him on a five up. Yeah. Can I do it? Can I do it? I did it. No, Lars. Why? You say you have, you play without feelings, it's just a game, it's for fun. But I can see your pain. And you painted him, didn't you? Like last night? No, this afternoon. Oh <laughs> no! What? Oh, so I, sorry! I just putting the flock on five minutes before I left. Oh no! Oh, I but, can uh, feel you, Lars. So here is the sniper. So Suko's down, Tamichenko is going to come back. <laughs> in the future with a harsh revenge. Yes, it's not going good for the Russians, are it? Uh, but they can perhaps do some retaliation. You have some aces up your sleeves, don't you? What's in the yes, truck? I'm going to disembark the guys from oh, the truck. Oh, no. Here they come. And they can disembark six inches. That's all the way up over here. Okay, then. All right. So what's happening? So I think I'm disembarking with these guys. Here they come. Here they come. And we measured. That's 12 inches. 12 inches. So everybody can do some shenanigans here. Oh. Except the flamer. Except for the flamer. And these guys have an SMG. Alrighty then. Except for that dude. He has an LMG. So one of them. LMG. Is, is, is loader. It's uh, yeah exactly. This is actually directly from the box. So we haven't done anything. Uh, so that's one, two, three, four. Four SM, uh, four uh, uh, submachine gun. Four submachine guns. Okay, it's eight items there. Five machine guns. I'm going to fire the SMG, not the pulse first. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's got two pulse first. You can use two on him if yep. you ever get the chance. So that's five SMGs. Yep. And one LMG. Alrighty then. So that's long range on those. Uh -huh. And short range on him. Long range. Move movement. Range, soft cover, so six. Sixes. That's ten dice. Sounds good. So let's see if ten the dice curse of the borrowed dice come back again. There is a six. And they are regular. And they don't kill, but I get another pin. I get another pin. All right. Then we have the LMG. Oh, sorry, I forgot. Fire it. And he's hitting a five. He's hitting a five. He is hitting two. Can you kill this time? Yes. So one one German dies. Ah, and I get another pin. The next die is coming from the bag, and it's uh, German again. It's actually only one uh, Russian again. So the Germans. 
They will retaliate. In this uh, squad, He's, they are taking uh, advance because I want to move shuffle them up a little bit more. So they're moving out, but at least half of the squad is staying in cover. And we guess we're taking heavy cover with this one. So Definitely. four, yeah, four riflemen firing. Long range movement. That's fives. Fives, so but I guess I just want to do some pins and maybe, maybe oh. I wanted to save those sixes because you are veteran and have body armor, so I need sixes to kill. Ah, no, oh my god, seriously, it's not fake. I promise, it's not fake. <laughs> I just killed two guys to do it. <laughs> see, see if I can take the flamethrower. No, I didn't. But I do kill two guys. I'm sorry, Lars. Doesn't feel good. But that was actually two sixes followed by two sixes. But not to hit. Oh no. Yeah, uh, that's the game of dice. But but you know that Germany is supposed to lose this one, not <laughs> win it. Yeah. Well, that's the thing. When we play historically, uh, we we kind of always happens. Remember Belgium. <laughs> Your lost eye. This is your sniper, I guess. Yeah. Hey, Lars, what's yeah. happening with the sniper? My sniper is actually advancing into this building. He's climbing! Of course, he's there. He got view of everything! Okay, so it's uh, my dice is left. Yep. And. Uh, Alright, uh, the first thing I do, I take you, men, snap too, because I can. Not because I have to, but because I can. So they will advance. They will advance up. Getting feeling with the Russians. They are not as scary as they should be. So they advance up. Maybe there is a Panzerfaust moving up later on to take that Panzer with that artillery wagon over there. But I'm uh, not in range for anything. Shoot. I am in range, so I will of course fire. Yeah, but hard a, long uh, range movement. Sixes four by sixes. Yeah, but that's happened. Yeah, just... I'm gonna roll two dice and see. No, double six. And it was only one rifle, dude, so. so you that's used it. up your sixes. I used, but that was worth it. And then he will also run up here. There, he's staying good. And then I got this squad, which will uh, take a fire order if I can manage, because I got two pins, but they are regular. So minus two, I do it, remove a pin, remove a pin. And then I will fire at your mean machine guns over here. So I'm firing with my rifles, and I have uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven within short range, but I do have a pin marker. Seven within short range. So that means you're out in the open, short range. But minus one because of the pin, so that hits on fours, and one that hits on fives. Yeah. Okay, Lars. Fours. Three hits. Three hits and fives. Nope. But sixes to kill. Can I kill some more? That would be huge. I don't kill anymore, but I do give you another pin. And that pin is, of course, very important for clearing that objective. And that, my friends, is end of turn two. Start of round three. Who gets the all important dice? <gasps> Germany. Germany. I'm well, guessing the I, big cat is going to wake up. I can't not do it. I can't. I have to fire and try to finish off your loss because that artillery piece there, it can really wreck the day. For uh, for uh, for uh, my infantry and so clearing up the bridge. Long range, soft cover. Long range is it long range? Yes, fifty yeah. something. 
So long range, soft cover, but he is he has done it before and I'm not moving, so I don't have to do any like fuel stuff. Hitting on five. Hitting on fives. Oh I miss. It's a three. That is a three. Lucky Russia. Lucky SU 152. Russians. Uh, Germany again. Germany again. Uh 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 well, 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 I know that this squad is dangerous and I don't want any more pins on this one. So he, they are going to fire again. Okay, that was kind of nice to remove the pin before they get more pins. So I'm going to do my order test. I'm going to do my order test. And this is what happens. They do the order test. And what did we say last time? Seven guys within short range. Yeah. One guy within long range. So three up. Yeah. On the short range. Yeah. Because no penalties. No. Oh, that was a bad roll. And four up on the guy last in the back. Oh well, he did it. But it's sixes, and I rolled a lot of sixes, Lars. Ah, not again! What have they like put put paper instead of instead of metal plates? Rusty metal. <laughs> Rusty metals. I mean, they are almost out of the game with all those pins. My God, Lars! My God, Lars! What's happening? I tell you what, it's two things. Curse of the Borrowed Eyes. I've been playing way too much Age of Sigmar where I'm invulnerable, essentially. <laughs> That's when you play those bone stuff. Yeah. <laughs> exactly. Uh, but I'm, I'm doing it again, Lars. I'm doing it again. And I can't resist the opportunity to clear out your your artillery piece over there. So I will fire again with my uh, medium howitzer and I will hit you on twos because I've got you already. Oh! The tide is turning! The red tide is turning! Maybe. I don't know. We'll see. Is it too late? We'll see. We'll see. We'll see. Oh. I'm, 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 I'm not cheating you, Lars. I'm not. I'm not cheating you. I will continue the uh, the bombardment here. They will do the same thing again and fire on this score. So four guys are out there hitting on fours because it was long range and pinning them down. Definitely pinning them down. Can I kill them? I spent a lot of time painting them and I do kill one. My god. Oh my god. That's... That's one useless guy, useless band of engineers. So I actually felt like if they did good, they would go for the bunker, but it's not happening. <laughs> they're not doing any no, good. No, but their cousins coming in the next wave will do it. <laughs> maybe, maybe in the next wave can make it Next dice, please. Because <laughs> that's how it is. Well, 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 well. Germany again. This, this is insane. This is crazy. This is crazy. Okay. I'm far too far away to get to this uh, this dangerous uh, tank there because I'm afraid of them. Afraid of him, but I will stay there. Maybe I will just... Maybe I go down or something if you fire at them. So I will just take my sniper. And uh, I guess I can fire at your sniper. Yeah. I'll do that. Because you moved him up, standing with his face in the in the in the window. Yeah. I yeah. I'll say yeah. Okay. Sorry, Lars. I'm doing it. But that I means think. I can see you too. Yeah. Duel. The snipers. Enemy at the gates. Enemy at the gates. Wrong city though. Wrong city. 
Three up, yep. because that's what snipers do. <laughs> that's a one. That is a one. That is a one. Hmm. Yes. Game can change fast. Game can change fast. At least I can't complain too much. Uh, but, uh, finally, your turn. Yes. Since we talked about uh, enemy at the gates, let's start the duel. The duel is in. It's on. My sniper is firing, firing on your sniper. Okay then. So that's hitting on a three. That's hitting on a three. Can you do it? Oh. This is unbelievable. Oh. Because Lars is not playing to win, he's playing for fun. He's this not fun anymore. He's not feeling it. I'm happy. Lars is happy. It's his dice. Oh, you still got the big, dangerous, big, big cannon. He will fire at the, the Tiger 2. That's Hiding there. Long range. Long range. Period. Period, long range. So it's hitting on four. Oh, yes. Hmm. Can you do it this time? Nah, Lars, what's happening? Why would you do this to yourself? I mean, Why? This is not a good commercial for those dice. Is no, this? but they roll good for me. Yeah, for you. <laughs> for me. <laughs> oh. Okay. You got a plan? It's still an objective game. Yeah, it's an object objective game. So I you got a lot it. of infantry, which is uh, intact without pins. Which can move up. You got three more rounds. This is round three. So you got I'm four going moments, to move I guess. up with these guys. Yeah, it's the flag is uh, important. Casualties isn't. Aren't. Isn't. Well, we said it before. You don't watch us for our perfect English. That one. That's, that's one thing that's for sure. Because we are not good at English. Okay, so they moved up. Will they fire? Definitely. They will fire. They, they are the uh, veterans, aren't they? Firing at those guys. Of course. So, uh, everybody except the SMGs will hit. So, so uh -huh. one, two, three SMGs. So, uh, four SMGs. Six dudes. And uh, the flag guy has tossed away every weapon. So, of that's course. five dudes. Five dudes. <coughs> Moved, long range, soft cover. Well, yeah, the boys behind there. So 6-6, six, six, I guess. Yep. Well. Fire dies. Fire dies, 6-6. Six, six. No 6. No 6. Lars is walking away. Trying not to show his inner feelings. <laughs> they boiling. are... They are... Boiling. Something. Okay, you still got These some guys. rushes. Uh huh. But they're, they're they are in it for the glory, aren't they? Yep. So they're moving up over here. Uh huh. Taking some shots. Maybe. Yep. That's what they have to do. They do, they do. Okay, and are you firing on the... I have to fire on those guys because here I cannot do it. That is true. Are you in range? You should be able to take yeah, a couple all, of all rifles. Ex all except the two guys in the back can shoot. Everyone can so shoot. 10 dice. But it's movement, long range, hard cover, inexperienced. 12 boys, but there's a lot of dices. You never know. You never know. I only need to pin some. There is one six out of twelve. There is nothing. Okay, so let's see what happens when I take the next dice. I usually take gray ones, but not this one. So mm -hmm. we got the infantry there. Oh, we forgot to roll off the roll if he. One no. off the table. No, yeah. Either way, and you got the cannon as well. What will you do? I have the truck and those guys over there. You do have the truck as well, and there, yeah, you got a lot of options here. 
and it's way too early to call the commissars and surrender and we'll send in the next wave I guess so there's a lot of infantry veteran infantry who, which still can do the job all you need is a minor defeat that's exceptional losses do they run? they have a range of 12 inches and they do run all of these guys are SMGs oh that is a close combat close combat yeah, they have to Sword. jump off the tank, you destroyed it. Yeah, they did, I did destroy it. Mm. Uh, yeah, if you see any rifles there, don't tell anyone. They got SMGs everywhere. Yeah. <laughs> so, next die, please? <laughs> yes, of course, next die is coming out of the bag. In Germany. Okay, then. Since you showed your infantry with the face with the infantry, I will take the opportunity to fire my machine gun on the flag bearers. This time it should be no problem being within 36. No. So it's a German Mingadier machine gun. Good juicy target for a sniper, but he has... Light cover. Uh, so long range light cover. Long range light cover, fives. There is not a single five here. Huh, those dice, they roll really. They roll. They roll. They roll. <laughs> Germany again. Okay then. Alright. You have fired everything and if everything that actually threatens these this squad. So I think I will just stand and shoot with my rifles because they are getting closer they are getting closer that's what I will do so here is the measure let's see if I can do this with one hand I'll hand the last uh, camera Okay then, let's see, the last one I actually can hit with everything. And the assault rifle, I think I got, no, this score does not have an assault rifle. You, uh, the champion got a champion. <laughs> He's uh, got an assault wrong game. Rifle. Wrong game. So we got, uh, we got two assault rifles. We got eight riflemen. Eight riflemen, long range, light cover. Yeah. You say right cover? Yeah. Hitting on five. That is two hits. It gives you the pin. And they are regular, but it doesn't matter because I don't kill anything. But I do give you that one pin. Because you always want to at least give a pin. Okay then, Lars. Game is going. It's getting, it's getting harder here. Red one. Yeah, I'm going to rally those guys. That sounds like a wise, wise decision. You have used everything that can threaten them, so... Yes, I I only have my officer left, so, so do get those pins off there. Definitely a, a successful uh, order test. And how many pins will you remove? Oh, lo and behold, within 12 inches. Oh, the flag. oh, what happens when you get the flag within 12? I have no idea because I've never you played against the flag. You can re roll the failed rally tests, and when successful, you roll two dice and choose the highest one. Oh, don't roll a but one then. No, you remove everything. That was definitely a good decision because now you can go up there and use the flamer. Yep. Okay, the last die for, not the last, we've got four dice left. Russia again. I'm going to try to repeat that success. Exactly, because you still have that dude over there. I tried to kill him, but I failed. 12 inches. Okay then. You can do this, Lars. You will remove all the pins. Turn the tide. Yes, no problem. Seven 
And removing three, you only got three, so they are out of, uh, out of, in the game again. They're in the game again, okay. And uh, Russia's lost die, uh, Germany's lost die, and I only got my, uh, I only got my officer, and I know your sniper is out of uh, range, I think I just go down here. Yeah, my sniper is gone anyway. He's done this turn as, as well, but I don't want to go into his range because I so want him left. So I have this guy left. And he has to do an order test because he lost half of his squad, didn't he? Yep. Uh, we forgot that, I guess. Yeah, let's do that now. Let's do it first. So sorry if we forget something. <laughs> but he's Russian. <laughs> so he stays in the game. He stays in the game. And him? Yeah, he's going to try to move up. Yeah, maybe he wins the game. You know, we know. You never know. Yeah. So he's moving. Uh, he's running, I guess. He's running. Yeah. He's going to run up. Yeah. Here. And that concludes nope. turn. Nope. Oh, you got a truck. Just come down. That concludes turn three. Oh, hey guys! Uh, you guys have probably already bought the tabletop battle dice and the tabletop battle dice bags and all that sort of stuff. But if you guys want shirts like this with the tabletop battle logo or coffee cups or stuff, we just started branding merchandise. So just click the link thingy. Uh, I don't know where he's going to put it. I think it's going to be around here. And use our web shop. Yeah. Lars has done his thinking and he definitely think it's hard to get a major victory for Russia but taking the two bridges with all this infantry yeah, it's definitely doable. It's still doable. Of course it is. So let's kick off round four. Round four it is. And the game starts with Germany. Germany, they uh, think this big, uh, big, uh, dangerous artillery piece there is definitely something you need to do something about. So the Tiger is doing what he's been doing the whole game. And that's hopefully rolling a five up. Not this time either. Nope, not this time either. Okay, Russia, what will you do? Russia is going to activate these guys. Of course. Now they can maybe redeem themselves. Casualties is definitely so nothing they care six about. Six inches. Okay. Oh, oh, oh. And the flamer is coming. Oh no, Germany. Volksgrenadier. And now the flamer is at six inches. Oh no, that's actually really, really good for you, Lars. And you are on the objective, securing it maybe with the with the body armor dudes. So I'm going to shoot with a flamer. Uh huh. The LMG. Yes. And an SMG. Okay then. Everything on this squad. Everything on that squad. Okay. Let's see the fun stuff first. That is uh, that is the flame, right? Yes. And incidentally, that's super short for that one. Super short, yes. For the submachine gun? Yeah. So let's do the submachine gun first. Submachine gun, gun first, all right. So movement, but no penalty for that. Super short. What's the three four. up? Four up. Four up, all right. Do you get cover for flamers? No, SMG. Okay, you're starting with SMG, sorry. Two hits. Two hits. Killing on four. Do not kill, but the pin is there. But it's uh, it's this dice roll that's coming. Then it's the LMG. Okay, so you take I'm saving. You're saving. Oh, you're so saving. the LMG. Uh huh. Uh, uh, LMG is four. It's a Russian thing, you know. Yeah. <laughs> so yeah, that's short range. Yeah. Movement and cover. Yeah. So five. Five. Two's two, thank you. you. One boy go down. What happens if I take? Now you shoot at the same time. Yeah. yeah. Okay then. Then it's the flamer. 
Can you hit with the flamer? And now you need to remind me, what are the rules for the flamer? Uh, it's the first time I ever play them. You're asking me? Yeah. Let's come back. Yes, the flamer. Yeah, so it hits on a D3. No, it hits. Oh, sorry, sorry, it's on three. <laughs> hits on three. This is maybe the most important. Oh, yes. Lars, you're redeeming yourself. So that's D6 hits? That's D6 hits. <laughs> but... It might be enough. Might be enough. So Ki kills on twos. You do kill. One more boy goes down. And you get D3 pins. D3 pins. Oh. Three more pins. Three more pins. And what did you else read about the flamer, Lars? You have to do a morale check, oh, regardless of casualties. Regardless. And if you fail it... I die? Yeah. And they run away? Yeah. And I got minus four, don't I? Yes. So I need some snake eyes, almost. Seven. Seven is not enough. So that unit is... Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Oh no. That was actually important for you, Lars. Yes. It was important for you. Okay, let's see the next die. No, I just noticed. Uh, I had to save that unit to take them out. Yeah, but you didn't need to. They're in the way now. <laughs> <laughs> no, they're in the way. Now once, I go. Once, once again, I block myself. <laughs> once again. And now I got a good. Sh uh oh. Russia again. Russia is coming back. And then I can do something else with them. Yeah? So what's that? They can run, I guess. No. Move up, take a shot. Up here. Alright. And what will they do? Put a shoot at that, those guys. Alright. Everybody's within range. Everyone is within range. That's 12 dice. 12 dice is. But inexperienced. Yeah. Long range. Yeah. Cover. Six eggs. But hopefully. Hopefully. All right, Lars. There is one six. Can you do another and get me a pin? Nope. Close, but not close enough. Okay then. Let's see the next die. It goes to. Russia again. Okay then, Russia is definitely doing it now. Oh, big boy is getting... And... What will she I'll, do? I'll be so lucky with your tiger. Yeah. I'm just going to leave it. I think that's you a wise choice. Have those. That's short range. Short range? Butt cover. Butt cover? So it's not four. No, because I'm going down. Yeah, but that, that's half in the unit. The hits. Oh. No, no, you're uh, shooting directly, aren't you? Yeah, I'm shooting directly. So it's a six. <laughs> that is a six. I, I have to do it because you will kill that Oscar. I didn't have to. No. <laughs> but I did. But I did. That was good because they are in a good spot of shooting over here and everything. And you are moving up with the Russians. Oh, finally me. What will I do? I will fire my sniper at your sniper. Let's see. Can they hit this time? Three up. Ah! <laughs> Interesting game this. Because it's changing. And it's changing fast. My turn again. Okay, I will handle you the camera here. So... My turn this time, and uh, let's see what can we do. What can we do? You moved your infantry there. You haven't moved these ones over there. Mm hmm. But you still have that dangerous. Is just one dude there? Yes, a permanent minus one to hit. Permanent, and uh, maybe I shouldn't care so much about that one. My howitzer will fire, he has to fire on indirectly, that's how it is. He fires at... I need a good, I think I will actually take a shot on these. So you're giving up that hitting on twos? Yeah, I am. Interesting. 
I have. Yes, maybe it's bad, I don't know, but I would, they are getting close and they are veterans. And I, if I get, can get them, I would be, a six. I hit on a six. Oh, no. It's a four. Without ranging in, you probably move, but anyway. I wanted to try it. Russia? All right. My sis. Sissy, Sissy gun there. And he's firing at your infantry over there. So hitting on a six. Hitting indirectly, hitting on a, not that one. Not hitting on five. Not hitting on five. So another die over here, Lars. And the color of the die is? Red. Russia again. What then my doing? sniper is going to shoot at your sniper. Yeah, of course that's not. You probably miss. You know that. <laughs> but <laughs> anyway, can your sniper do it? He can do it. Nice. Can he kill him on a four? Oh yeah, you do. The tide is turning. The tide is turning. So, so he gets I'm, I'm, hit. I'm, I'm guessing you're taking out the sniper now, not the assistant. Well, it's your... Uh, no, it's actually your choice, because the sniper you always choose. Sniper bye-bye. Sniper bye-bye. Okay, he's gone. He's gone, and he's got a pin. And I lost half of the score, so I have to take more on the check. Nine. They're regular. Minus one. They are destroyed. Because you're not Russian. I'm not Russian. Ah! So tide is turning. Yeah, Tide is definitely turning Yes, up. Lars was almost... I was ready to give up. But ready to give up? Never give up until the fat lady sings. Yes, and she's not around, are, are she? No. Is she? No. <laughs> well... I, I, I divorced her. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh. Uh, Ooh. My ex-wife doesn't watch the video, so I'm good. <laughs> oh, okay, <laughs> she's your ex-wife, so... <laughs> yeah. Then Soviet. Soviet again. Uh, okay, you have a plan? You got a plan. Yeah, I have a plan. I'm going to activate this little dude over here. Dude over there. And he He's is... going to fire on those guys. Yeah, because he got a, got a rifle and it's definitely 24. That's 24. So it's 24. Going to long range. Uh -huh. Cover. Here is the die. Not that one. So, hitting on five. Hitting on five. Nope, no. Okay then. The game is going on. Russian infantry is doing the job. Can Germany stop them? Germany is firing the machine gun here. And they are firing on these ones over there. Yep. So Lars, please hold the camera. And let's see, I'm definitely within range. No problem. Um, why didn't I shoot on these boys? Anyway, I said those. So I, they, I can kill a lot of them. Uh, so long range. Don't think you actually get so much cover there. No, I think I get light cover. Yeah, light cover. From, the, from those three. three. Yeah. Five up. Two. Killing on threes because you are inexperienced. Killing two. Also they are green. Important. They are green. What will your green roll do? Nothing. Nothing. They remain inexperienced. Uh, good for me. <laughs> I guess it's good for me. Okay, Lars. The next die is coming up. We are in Germany again. Yeah. Not holding back anymore now. Moving up here. Moving them out. Sixes. See, first dude over there. I know you got a flamer. You have to check if you got fuel on the flamer. We forgot that one. Yeah. Two boys in super short. Two boys in super short. That means they will hit on threes. And we got one, two, three, four, five, six, Checking seven, for the fuel. Eight. Checking for fuel first. Oh, he's good to go. I think it's on a, on a one, isn't it? So two boys on super short hitting on threes because they moved. Do them first. Two hits. Eight 
dudes hitting on horse because they moved but they are within short range that's a lot of hits Lars that's a lot of hits and I only need two sixes now then I can take them out and here it goes I do get three sixes I almost killed them all Lars will I take the flamer out I actually do take both the flamer and the machine gun Good for Germany. <laughs> yep. Flamer and machine gun. And which other guy will you sacrifice? Oh, I'll keep the Panzerfaust guy. Panzerfaust, yes, of course. And I kill half of the squad. So you have to do some morale checking here. Eight day or EXP. Veteran. Uh, Veteran, so no problem. Eight there is definitely a successful one. So that was that squad over there moving up, being aggressive. And you die. Russia. So, Germany. Germany's lost die. And it's the officers. And they have uh, no good targets. So they are going down. And now it's Russia's last two dice. What so will the Russians do? The Russians will. Oh, you got two, you got the... Don't fail any morale tests! I'm not concerned about the morale tests, I'm more concerned about... Um... Huh? Yeah, at least your tape measure. Okay, you're more concerned yeah, about my tape measure. <laughs> Will they still keep on running here? Taking the objective? We got submachine guns? No, 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 no. It's hard to get gouged there. Uh... Yes. Yeah. Is it 18 or is it 24? Uh, I'm just going to move advance over. Advance here. and hope for to get you probably can get some. You I also have a juicy target over there. Yeah, but he's down small to you. Everything, yeah. Yes. But taking him out would definitely That would help because then I have to move my artillery piece. And uh, so, then it's here. basically out of the game. So you got some shots over there, don't you? I got three guys. Three guys? That means six dice. But first I need to check past the morale. Of test. course. Lars, now you're cheating. Past. Past. And then I'm going to shoot with three guys. Yeah. So it's movement, which is negated. So it's long range and cover. Yes. So hitting on fours, not fives. Hitting on fives. Not a single five. It's been a very interesting dice rolling in this game. Anyway, the you remove... Uh, the truck it just goes down. The truck goes down. So All right. back with round five. Important fifth dice. Germany. Germany again. Germany again. You had the first dice every single round. Yes. Uh, so I got two options. I can f continue firing at the, uh, at the dangerous... Uh, Dangerous SU-1052, or I can use my die on a 5 up and take that one out. But I am firing at the SU-152, and this time, this time I can roll a 5 up. Can I do it? I can't do it! <laughs> ah! Frustrating! I'm not playing for fun. I'm playing to win. Oh no! <laughs> <laughs> well, I, I said I was going to activate this one due to your tank, but your tank is is done. It's done. So maybe some. Uh, 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 now he's moving up. Now he's moving up. What will he do? Oh 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 oh! Tank riders with some machine gun. Definitely something scary here. What will they fire at? Okay, so it's uh, 14 dice, 7 boys can shoot, and I'm not going down. So you hit on 5, and you kill on 5, because they are veterans, and I see a lot of hits, a lot of hits. Oh, I I should have gone down, but it wouldn't help you, I so guess. So killing on 4s? Killing on 5s, because that's a veteran squad. <gasps> 3 dead. 
<coughs> that was important. And the six doesn't do anything. So three casualties here. One, two, and three. And a pin marker, but I'm not scared of the pin. Okay, Lars. Russia. The tide is turning. What will they do? Yeah. They're firing at? The same guy. Same boys. Oh, it looks like he can secure this bridge. And I have to go down if you hit. Oh, oh, oh no, oh, you didn't. The tanks, they did do in good in the beginning and then they just... No, my tanks did not do you, good. Yeah, you didn't do anything actually. Your tank has been useless. Germany! Germany is definitely taking... Trying to take out this squad because if I can take them out, you're in trouble with securing that. So my howitzer, he has got a five up, and I was waiting and hoping to get the opportunity now to roll that five up. I'm gonna use this die. Are you ready, Lars? I'm ready. That's ah uh, ah uh, ah uh, ah. Uh. Four up, four up. Still got the chance. Germany, Germany, I think I will use the machine gun team here and fire at that squad, giving them a pin, giving them a pin. That's the plan. So I got six dice hitting you on long range, long range and... Um, Light cover, I guess. Yeah. Fives. Let's see. Definitely just one. Just one. Can I kill one? I do kill one. I do kill one because they are veteran. I do kill one and I give you a pin. And it's in, it was kind of an important pin, Lars. Okay, Lars. Red one. Soviet Union. What will they do? Finishing this war. Okay, what will he do? Super short. He's just gonna shoot. Oh, he has to take a morale check. He does it. He's gonna shoot. He on both. hits, kills on fours. Not killing anything, but giving them a pin. Okay. And order die this time is Russia again. Or the infantry squad, the not green, just inexperienced squad. It's moving up. Maybe I will do some assaulting. That would be fun. So moving and shooting. Moving and shooting. That's short range. Yeah. For all those guys, it's one, two, three, four, five, nine guys. Yes. Ten guys. But they are inexperienced, so you will hit on fives. And you get those extra pins there and pay, maybe kill a guy or two. You never know. Fives, three hits, so that's another hit. And let's see if you kill fours. Not a single kill, but another pin. Another pin. Okay then, that's how it goes, getting closer to the end here, and Russia again, there you go Lars, sniper dude, what will the sniper dude do? I forgot to take out the dice, did mm, Not sure. Yeah. The sniper, what's he doing? Oh, his dice is still here from earlier. Oh yeah. Okay, just put him uh, put him back then. Yeah. The sniper is going to snipe at those. He's going to say, oh, you're trying to pin them down, aren't you? Yeah. That's... Okay, hitting on three. Hitting on threes. Yes, killing on... Not threes. But they got three pins, and that's a lot of pins. Okay, then. Going to be on the last Germany. Germany is going to activate snap 2, I think. Can you take the camera, Lars? 
Take the camera. They are going to... He has got an assault rifle. Yeah, he's trying, he's moving up here. And he's firing, definitely within 18. So two dices, long range, but not for moving, since it's assault. So four ups, hit once, and... No kill. Aren't they just regular? No, they're veterans. They're veterans. Scary, scary. But I do pin you. And then these boys has to, of course, make a morale check. And they manage because I have my officer. So they actually manage. And they will just stay there and fire. And the rifleman is, you can see the assault rifle can hit two of their assault rifles. At fours, it's long range, cover, minus, so fives. Yeah. Fives, let's do that one first. Fives, one hit. And then we got one, two, three, four, five dudes with the rifle. And they are probably within short range so four yeah that means four hits kills on fives because they are veterans that's scary but I do kill two of them I do kill two of them yeah that's how it goes Russia. Okay, I'm going to activate the sis three. Sis three, and, and she he is. He's going to. He is indirectly on those guys. Over okay, there. let's see. Uh, can you I need manage a six to hit? But if I hit, if you hit, you do damage. No. And the last dice coming out of the bag is Russia again, and you got these boys. And the truck. So I'm going to try to activate these guys. Okay, don't fail a morale test, otherwise I will just bombard them. Oh, you do not. Okay, what will they do? I guess I remove this die over there. They are going to move over here. Yeah. Staying within cover. So that's one, two, three SMGs, wrist rifles. Mm -hmm. I'm to shoot over there. So the rifles are at long range, SMGs cannot do anything. Okay, how many so rifles? One, two, three, four, five, six. Six rifles. Six rifles, there you go. So long range. Cover, Orange, movement, cover, sixes. Cover. All right. One six, that's a pin. And that's a kill. He goes that way. And the last die is going to be Russia. You got one Russian and one German left. Oh, that's the lonely dude, yeah. He's just shooting with his rifle, yeah. getting some pins again. Long range, cover, hitting on five. Hitting on five. Mm. Ooh, do you kill one? You don't, but you give me another pin. And the last die is Lars. Your truck goes down. And the last German die, they are just giving it the boys over there, and they are. Rallying. Can they do it? Oh no. no. They don't because they are regular. So they so go down. They go down. That finishes off round, round five. Right. It's not looking good for the uh, Germans. It's the last turn. And uh, the only thing the Russians has to do is put some boots on the on the bridges. And then they win the game.
They will definitely not make it a major victory, but uh, minor for sure. Minor for sure. Because those veterans, hard things to do. I needed to be. Uh, I was lucky in the beginning, but uh, not lucky enough to win a late war, Germany. Russians. Yes, Lars has decided to activate his uh, inexperienced squad. They're going to advance and shoot. Advance and shoot. And that makes it really hard for me to uh, to uh, actually <laughs> activate that because then I got four pins and I can't just... I have to take the objective. Uh, the Russian boots are doing it again. And Russians are doing it again. Lining up there, shooting. Don't think they have any casualties, do they? Uh, those guys. They got one casualty or two. Three, I think. Oh, it was yeah, it was three. Sorry. But they're, anyway, they're shooting at those guys. Yeah. Putting the five, six front most at super short, and the four back. Because those two. Yeah. So six and super short with movement. So hitting on. Threes? No, they are inexperienced still. Hitting on four. Hitting on four. And there are four guys in the back hitting on fives. Yes. Okay then. Starting with the six in front. Hitting on fours. Fours. Yes, that's a lot of fours. Can you kill? Um, no, you first. And four guys in the back. Yeah. Hitting on. There's two more. Do you kill? You do kill a lot of them. Four of them. Holy, holy, holy. Oh. Not good, another pin. Okay, and the next die is, if it's red again, I'm in trouble. It's red again. Will you finish them off, Lars, or what's your plan? Yeah, I yes. want to move this guy and... Yep, yep, just okay. still, you can't leave you know, just one guy left. No. Because now I got five pins if you hit me. You so most... he's going to move around like that mm -hmm. and shoot at super short. Oh no. With his SMG. With his SMG. So two dice. Those are definitely hitting on threes. Yeah, yeah, of course. And on super. Well, anyway. And you do kill another one. That means five pins. Hmm. Okay. This is going to be hard. It's going to be hard for Germany at least. They're not winning any major. And oh, with all these red dice coming up, pinning them down. It looks to me that Schmuck. you can... The Russia may just take this one. So, he is hitting on a four. He is hitting on a four. Can you hit this time? Can you hit this time? Oh, yes. ho, 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 ho. you're pie plating all of them. And that's a uh, three inch. No, it's a heavy howitzer. It's like four inches or something. There's no way you're. Oh, uh, it's actually all but one? five something. So hitting all but all but one of them. Uh, all but one. So five. I actually don't remember if it's four or five. <laughs> anyway, two top. Oops, that's one dead unit. Lars? No, there's one guy left. <clears throat> yeah. I think you actually won the game there. And that's D3 pins? That's D3 pins. Two, Two more pins. pins. That means a lot of pins and all the boys over there dead. Huh. That was not good for Germany. Lars. Moral test, please. Moral, if I fail this one, I got plus one for him, but eight mm. is not enough. He's goodbye. So, dice removed, and the next die goes to Germany. Huh. I will actually make this fast. Fast, because if you, if you fail to activate those, the game is over, essentially. Yeah. And I have to elim eliminate this squad. But then you can just run up with those. Yeah. So, uh, 
Yeah, I think I will take a morale test with this, boys. See if I can manage to do it. No, I don't. I think... I think we. I will actually give a minor victory to Russia. Does it feel right for you, Lars? Feels like it's... It's where we're at. Ah, uh, because there's no way I can stop you. I have to hit on a 6 with the howitzer. The tank, of course, can do, but I don't inspire Tiger Fear with the new rules. So I guess I have to move him up, be more aggressive, but I wasn't. Hmm. You, you, can, you can still put it off, but it's very, very, very unlikely. It's very unlikely. It's late in the evening, let's say. Thank you, and good game, Lars. Yeah. Oh, hey, guys. Uh, you guys have probably already bought the Tabletop Battle Dice and the Tabletop Battle Dice Bags and all that sort of stuff. But if you guys want shirts like this with the Tabletop Battle logo or coffee cups or stuff, we just started branding merchandise. So just click the link thingy. Uh, I don't know where he's going to put it. I think it's going to be around here. And use our web shop. 